to Ghost Powered Entertainment. I'm your host, Kanan Becker, and today we talk about the 10 greatest Christmas horror movies of all time. Christmas, everyone. So I hope you're having a great Christmas so far. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, well, I hope you're having a great holiday. But I thought it would be fun this week to give you guys my 10 absolute favorite Christmas horror movies of all time. Now, keep in mind, this is my list, but I would love to hear what yours is. So down in the comments, tell me what your 10 favorite Christmas horror movies are. And with that, let's get to the list. Santa's sleigh. Go ahead, kid. Let's see what Santa got you. I hate children. So Santa's Sleigh is an absolutely wild, over-the-top Christmas horror movie. It stars Bill Goldberg, who was a pro wrestler and a pretty big one at that, at least at the time this movie was made. I'm not sure if he's still wrestling or whatnot, but he is savage in this movie. Yes, there is a Santa Claus. He plays Santa Claus in a very, very, very different version of Santa Claus. He is savage and evil and mean and just goes on this killing spree, killing everything. It's gory, it's wild, and it's an absolutely fun time that if you've never checked it out, I think you definitely should because this movie is so much fun. Christmas Evil, the night he dropped in. So Christmas Evil is a movie that I just discovered last year while watching Joe Bob Briggs on The Last Drive-In on Shudder. He had it on his Christmas special last year, and I'm like, what is this? I'd never heard of it. And I fell in love with it from the jump because this movie is so weird, so uncomfortable, so bizarre, so many just strange things go on in this movie, but in a very charming way that I definitely had fun with. I told you he'd be happy that we remembered him. Keep in mind though, this movie is not gonna be an uplifting, happy, fun type of Christmas movie. It does have fun, campy elements, but for the most part, this is a weird, twisted, demented guy who dresses up as Santa Claus and just goes on a killing spree. So it's got a lot of twisted, dark elements to it as well. Either way though, I think it's a great one and it definitely needed to be on this list. Can exes just go away? La, 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 la. Fuck! La, fuck! La, fuck! La. So Better Watch Out is definitely one of my favorite Christmas horror movies. It is definitely full of Christmas but it's also just very different and I think that's a lot of what I love about this movie. It has a great twist so if you don't know the twist please try your best to watch this movie without knowing the twist because if you go into it like I did without knowing the twist, it's definitely a lot more fun. What was that? What the fuck? Oh my god. Get away from the window. There's someone there. It starts out like it's just gonna be another home invasion type of scenario, but then there's this very different twist in it that makes the movie go in a very different direction. But this movie is wild. It has some very gory elements, funny stuff, just a very different kind of movie that is so much fun. You've made it through Halloween. Now try and survive Christmas. Silent Night, Deadly Night. So Silent Night, Deadly Night, the OG, is definitely one of the greatest Christmas horror movies. It's kind of, in a lot of ways, one of the very first, because besides Black Christmas, this is the first to take Christmas and do something demented and twisted with it. This movie also has a very wild history because when it first came out, people were trying so hard to boycott it and get it pulled from theaters. But all that did was put 
this movie into a different stratosphere. A movie that probably no one would have really ever heard of ended up being a big deal because everybody's like, what? What's this really controversial horror movie? We gotta go and check it out. In a lot of ways, this is just another stereotypical slasher though, but it has Santa Claus and that element and all the Christmas stuff going on around it just makes for a lot of fun and definitely one I always watch this time of year. So Anna in the Apocalypse is another one that is one of my favorites for this time of year. It's strange to me because it's as much fun as this movie is, you just don't hear a lot of people talk about it. And I don't know why, because it really is a lot of fun. It's like a musical Christmas movie that's got Shaun of the Dead vibes all over it. Oh no. What? Justin Bieber's a zombie. It's got all this crazy zombie over the top fun like Shaun of the Dead, as well as this crazy musical element that just feels weird and out of place. It looks amazing with just bright colors and Christmas vibe all over it. It's just a great little movie that I think more people need to check out because it really fits well for this time of year. So Black Christmas really is the precursor to the movie Halloween. And I think it's even more dark and even more disturbing and really is one of the greatest horror movies ever made. It's one that not enough people, even to this day, still give credit to in my opinion. Either way, it is a fantastic horror movie to watch for Christmas because it is absolutely, genuinely disturbing. It just feels cold, it feels scary, it feels like a movie that is very demented and disturbing, and yet it goes so well with that whole Christmas theme. I just think it's a fantastic horror movie in general, but especially for one for this time of year. That was Mrs. Deagle. I'll bet every kid in America would like to have one. They might even replace the dog as the family pet. All right, so Gremlins, of course, had to be on this list because as far as Christmas fun, it doesn't get any more fun than Gremlins. I love all the crazy little characters as well as the fact that this movie really takes me back to being a little kid and back to the 80s and just that whole vibe that was going on then. Billy, what are these things? Gremlins. It looks brilliant, the acting is a lot of fun, just in every way. This is a great little movie that has Christmas splashed in the most fun way all over it. I love this movie, and it definitely is one of my favorite Christmas horror movies, for sure. He knows if you've been bad or good. And he doesn't give up. Rare Exports is arguably the greatest Christmas horror movie, in my opinion, because this movie is unique, it looks brilliant, the acting is great, it has a really weird and twisted vibe that has to do with Christmas. This mountain is like a giant icebox. For storing what? Drill deep. Prepare the dynamite. You have a grave. The Santa Claus idea that this movie goes with is just awesome. It's very disturbing in a lot of ways. It has these creepy, dark moments. I just love this movie, and I think it's one that not enough people still talk about, but it really should be at the very top of your Christmas horror list. And if you haven't seen this, this needs to be the first movie that you check out from this list. Christmas. Nothing bad's gonna happen on Christmas. So Krampus, of course, had to be on this list. I adore this movie. I mean, look, I got the Krampus dome mask right there. <laughs> 
I'm a big fan of Michael Doherty. He also directed Trick or Treat as well as this movie. So I'm just a fan of his. I love what he did for Halloween. And to me, this is what he did for Christmas. It's just like this perfect chapter two to his holiday book, so to speak. I love the look of this movie. I love the vibe. It's got humor to it. It's got creepiness. He is the shadow of St. Nicholas. This is just one of my favorite Christmas movies, period. Much less the fact that it's got horror in it. Just in general, it's a fantastic little movie. And lastly on this list is a Christmas horror story. This is a movie I discovered not too long ago and is now one of my all time favorite Christmas horror movies because this movie looks brilliant. It's got all the things. It's so much fun. Crazy zombie elves, like a crazy savage Santa Claus who's kind of like this older Viking version of Santa Claus. I fear they may all become infected. It all come to this. So much cool stuff packed into this movie. Is it perfect? No. But if you're looking for a fun movie this time of year that has some badass action as well as creepy horror elements, it's an anthology. It's just great. It's so enjoyable in my opinion and one that should be on anybody's Christmas horror list. All right, guys, that's my Christmas horror list. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave your comments down below. I'd love to hear more about what you would put on this list. And also, if you could do me a favor, hit that subscribe button and ding that little bell because that is the best way to keep track of this channel. And when I post videos like this, and I post videos like this every single week, I also want to give a huge, massive, enormous thank you to my patrons because you guys, yeah, you, your support seriously means so much to me. And if you would like to find out more about becoming a patron, the link is down in the description. And like always, thank you so much for watching. Please crush that like button. And remember guys, horror can be fun. I will see you guys next time. <laughs>